Right off the top, we're bringing you the latest on the armed robbery that happened late this afternoon at the Finger Lakes Healthcare Federal Credit Union on Hart Street in Elmira. Well, this is the second time that this bank has been robbed, and it was just a month ago the last time it happened. WNY's Kelly Meyer was on the scene all day and joins us live in the studio with the story. Kelly, what is the latest? Jen and Ben, the two suspects in today's robbery are still at large, which is the same for the suspect in last month's robbery. No sign on their whereabouts either. This was the scene around 4 o'clock after police got a call of an armed robbery at Finger Lakes Healthcare Federal Credit Union on Hart Street in Elmira, the same bank that was robbed on November 2nd. Two suspects reportedly entered the credit union, one armed with a handgun. The two suspects stole an undisclosed amount of currency and fled the credit union on foot, running east toward Walnut Street. We spoke with Elmira Police Department Lieutenant Joe Kane, who said everyone inside the bank was safe. This all happened just steps away from the Arnett Ogden Medical Center. Well, obviously, we are disappointed. Um, we've got some pretty shaken up folks. Dustin Hewitt, spokesman at Arnett Ogden, tells us they had a lockdown at the child care center just next door to the bank, but was happy everyone was okay. Anytime that an incident occurs in any of our facilities, um, we spend a lot of time studying what happened and studying the reaction to ensure that we are having the right reaction. Uh, to ensure that we're keeping our community, our patients, our staff safe. After two robberies in less than four weeks, some neighbors are shaken up. One man who lives across the street told us he's afraid to stay in the neighborhood. Fred Wagner says he won't leave, but is definitely being more careful. Even weary to answer the door for me. You know, who knows what out there. I didn't want to take any chances. Suspect 1 was last seen wearing an orange mask and green hunting jacket, and Suspect 2 was wearing a black mask and black jacket. They're said to be driving a 1990s to early 2000s model light color four-door sedan. Anyone with information regarding the suspects, please contact the Elmire Police Department at the number on your screen. Kelly Meyer, WENY News.